All right. Hello, everyone. Welcome to Essential Oils 101 and Rollerball Love. We are going to talk to you about one of our favorite ways to get started with essential oils, and that is making all different kinds of rollerballs. So I have some here in the head. Whoop, I have some here. Um, Lucid is going to show us some of that. But I'm going to get started with what we're going to talk about a little bit and some of the oils. So uh, my name is Sass Mari and I'm an executive leader with Young Living and I have been using essential oils um, for over four years now and they have helped me um, from things like helping my kids sleep, helping me sleep, helping me be a little less stressed, helping my gut. Uh, flavoring my water, um, helping my kids when we're sick and things like that, building up our immune system. So all the awesome things um, that we want essential, essential oils to do. Go ahead, next slide. All right, so our disclaimer statement um, are just that these statements have not been evaluated by the FDA. Products uh, discussed are not meant to diagnose, treat, cure, or prevent disease. Um, we are just expressing our views as moms who love these oils and we are not medical professionals. Um, they, and a medical professional does not necessarily reflect the views of young living essential oils. So views, uh, views expressed are only applied to young living essential oils. Individual re results may vary. All right. And what are essential oils? You might be wondering. It's basically the extraction of a plant. Okay, so they're a lifeblood of a plant. When these plants are grown in the right conditions, harvested at the correct time, and distilled with the utmost care, they can aid in keeping our bodies healthy, well, and happy. So our bodies intend to be. Essential oils are composed of tiny molecules. These molecules so small that they can pass through our tissues and directly into our cells. Our our systems. Sorry, guys. Lucinda, do you mind finishing this slide? Hi, so as Kathy was saying, we're going over essential oils. Essential oils are composed of teeny molecules. These molecules are so small that they can pass through our tissues and directly into our cells. Our systems are super effective and can transport these molecules all over our bodies within a matter of minutes. <coughs> So Young Living has this fantastic seed to seal guarantee. Kathy, are you back? Yeah, I'm really sorry. I very much struggle Hi. with um, my kids being awake at this time and trying to get them ready for bed. So, um, all right, so Young Living um, seed to seal, you guys. This is why I choose this company. Young Living has over 100 farms in over 70 different countries. Um, and the reason why they are the number one uh, premium essential oil company in the world is exactly this. So Young Living starts um, when they cultivate, distill and harvest their seeds, all these things. Young Living is using, uh, they're not using any toxins or anything like that in their farming. They are just using uh, essential oils and their hand uh, harvesting. They really, go down to kind of the source. So if there is a good, they're making sure everything is testing at um, the premium level to be put into your home. So if the seed um, doesn't really look well, it won't get planted. And if there's something kind of going on with the plant, they won't harvest that to get it distilled. They make sure that everything is tested um, so that when it gets to the distilling site, it's tested even more multiple times and and then it's sealed up. Now, if these products don't reach the testing standards, they don't come into our home. So that is why I love Young Living. They really make sure that you're getting the um, most uh, essential oil in your product because when we go to the store and we buy uh, things at the grocery store, essential oils at the grocery store, we um, they are diluted with synthetics and things like that. And when you're getting Young Living essential oils, you're making sure it is 100% essential oil in that bottle. So that's what you want to make sure and look for that seed to seal, um, the brand that we all trust. So there's three ways to use essential oils. One is topically. You can, uh, you know, when you're first using essential oils, you want to dilute them. I like to use a organic 
jojoba oil. You can use coconut oil, V6 uh, vegetable oil. Um, and you dilute them, you put them on uh, areas that, you know, you need maybe the massage or, or if you're not feeling well on your chest. Um, massage into the area. You can also diffuse like putting things on your chest in the shower or um, aromatically, you can also do that. So I'll put, uh, topically I'll put essential oils on my body and go in the shower or I'll use them aromatically and I'll put them like um, on the shower wall and I'll go in there. But you can put them in a diffuser aromatically. You can just put them in your hand um, and smell them into your palms. Inhale, you can even just smell the bottle like that. There's a lot of different ways to aromatically use essential oils. Another way is to use them internally. We're going to talk about um, what this little guy has, things you read a little bit later, but you can also talk about, um, or we can also add essential oils to our water, um, to cooking when we're, when we're using meals. I'll add them to my kids' ningxia and things like that. When you are ingesting essential oils, you want to make sure that if you're putting them in water, things like that, you're not putting them into plastic. You're using glass or stainless steel and oils dilute plastic. Um, and also if you have, uh, if you're cooking, you're not using a direct flame. You're kind of taking things off the burner and then putting your oils in, or you can bake with them as well. Add them into capsules. That is another way too. So we are going to get started. I am going to quickly talk about uh, about 12 essential oils. And then Lucinda is going to talk to you guys about some other products and how we can get started with making roller balls and then how you can get started with your young living journey. So, all right. Frankincense, my friend, I have this right here because it's by my sink in my bathroom, which is where I am right now. Um, I use this every single day under my tongue. I use frankincense and CBD to help support my depression. Um, my postpartum was pretty bad, but I've had depression uh, since I was a teenager. So if you're someone like me that will just have it for the rest of your life, this is a really, really good oil to help kind of just keep you regulated um, all day, every day. It's a very powerful oil to promote promotes um, healthy looking skin. Also, you can add it to um, your creams and things and it promotes feelings of relaxation. I really like to diffuse frankincense when company is coming over, also with lemon, it smells really good. Lavender, everyone has heard of this. Calming, calming, calming for sure. Um, this is the one safe oil that I use on my kids and I don't dilute, it is super safe. Um, I put it on skin when my kids are, you know, itchy or I'll even, uh, uh, if there, there's cuts on their hands or anything, I'll um, clean it out with thieves soap and then put some lavender in there. I will diffuse this in their bathtub or the shower at night and even put it in their diffuser. I also like to make lavender like lemonade with this. We're doing a do it yourself this summer where you guys can make and take that. And I like to add this to my tea sometimes. One drop is a little too floral, so I'll put a toothpick swish and swirl that around. Lemon, lemon has an awesome, awesome, um, uh, what do I say? Awesome uh, superpower, as I want to say. It is kind of like a degreaser. That's my favorite way to use lemon. I am a mom with twin toddlers. They're sticky stuff all over my house is what I'll say. I don't know what it is, whatever. But lemon is an awesome way to kind of get those stickiness off. If there's some things uh, that are too sticky on my stove, I'll use lemon. I will add lemon to my cleaners and clean my windows and glass with it. And it is awesome with for antioxidant properties. Um, I really like to use lemon when I'm not feeling well. Um, support your immune system. Use it a lot of in teas. I cook with it a lot and I put a lot of it in my water. So lemon is awesome. Awesome, awesome oil. Peppermint. Uh, peppermint is awesome. I always talk about for the digestive um, function. I was using uh, a peppermint oil that I, a doctor recommended me. I had a lot of gut issues to use peppermint oil for my nausea and stuff. And I started to use peppermint. Um, but then what happened was like, I, I was using it and it, it was like helping me a little bit, but it really wasn't doing anything. 
And then I switched the brand. So the brand that I had got was actually a brand from the pharmacy that they actually had the pharmacy and it wasn't really doing anything. And then I later learned that there was synthetics in it that they weren't helping me at all. So when I started switching out my peppermint, it definitely helped. Um, when I, now when, you know, we talked about the disclaimer, everything's different for everyone. Some people can smell peppermint and their nausea will like go away. Some people diffuse it. Some people nothing works for me unless I personally rub it on the bottom of my feet, which are your VitaFlex points. So if something's not working for you, try it a different way. Um, so for a while, I was like, oh, peppermint, like it helps everyone this way. And it helps me, but I always have to make sure I put it on my feet. So I like that. I like to kind of put a drop under my tongue to help me focus when I'm going to sit down and do some work. But re reality is I never sit down. So um, <laughs> I can't. It keeps me up. I'm not sitting down right now. It keeps me up and moving. So, all right, next slide. Ooh, peppermint's also good in brownies, by the way. All right, citrus fresh is my favorite one in fruit salad. So if you're making fruit salad, you need a little freshness to that, add some of that. Um, also a lot of cleansing properties. So if my tummy's kind of not doing well, I'll add this to my tincture, add this to some water. And citrus fresh is definitely one that is... Um, can kind of wake you up in the morning too, right? It's a blend of citrus oils and spearmint. So I like to diffuse this in the morning or I'll even put uh, citrus on myself or in my shower in the morning uh, to wake me up. All right, guys, Digize. This is my gateway oil. What I mean by that is this is the product that made me truly believe that these products are premium and amazing and can seriously help support our health and wellness. Um, but my story with Digize, uh, my shortened version is I was in the hospital very sick um, every month. Yeah. Sorry, just yelling at my kids to get out of the shower. Um, I was really sick every month with gut issues and I like three to five times a week, I would have episodes. Once a month I was going in um, into the hospital. They couldn't figure it out. I was on about seven different medications. Uh, they couldn't figure out what was going on in my stomach. They said, well, we don't know what's going on. So we have IBS, get your sister, please. And, and then I started taking dye dyes. I didn't even want to smell this oil because it smells like black licorice and I hate black licorice. I was like, I don't even want to smell it. So how can I put it in my mouth? So my friend was like, just put it in a shot glass of water and see what happens. And I was like, fine. So I did. And I was like, Ugh. I kept it up and I'm so glad I kept it up. You guys, because within one month I was, I was, I, I didn't go to the hospital after I did that. I never went back to the hospital with those gut issues. Um, within seven months, I was off of all my medications I needed. And now I just put this in a capsule. So digest has really, really helped. Um, my health and wellness, um, especially with my gut, but it is really good for hangovers. Seriously, the next day, if you're kind of hungover, put this in a shot glass of water, um, or if you need some kind of digestion, I have used this on my daughter when she's been constipated and she's gone immediately after I've rubbed some diluted on her stomach. So digest is definitely one to keep in your arsenal for sure. All right, guys. Thieves, thieves. All right. I want to mention something real quick um, before I move on is you're seeing some of these labels are red or purple or color. And some of these labels, oh, I get in the shower. Some of these labels have white labels. Now we talked about different uses. The oils that have the color labels, the directions on the oils show you how to topically use oils or topic or how to diffuse them. Any of the oils in the white are going to tell you how to use them internally. Now, the FDA does not allow essential oil companies to put topical and ingest directions on the same label. So Young Living has separate labels for you. So now when you see something like Thieves Oil, um, it also comes in a brown bottle and it's the same exact thing inside the bottle, right? It's just not going to have the same direction. So if you run out of Thieves Vitality and you have a regular Thieves, that's safe too. Um, just, you know, it's just to share the different directions. So but thieves oil is really supportive for our immune system. Uh, they make toothpaste, uh, hand soap, mouthwash, laundry soap, dish soap. It, did I not, did I say hand soap? I don't know, but all the things um, they make out of thieves products because they help 
protect our immune system, right? They clean and help protect our immune system. So during the bubonic plague, why is it called thieves oil? The uh, grave robbers, the thieves who would steal from the sick and the dead um, would rub certain things on them, eucalyptus, lemon, rosemary, clove, uh, cinnamon, and they would steal and they wouldn't get sick. So when they got caught, um, he said, oh, you know, they used to chop their hands off. We won't chop your hands off if you tell us what you use in order to not get sick. So, and it was the blend of these oils. So thieves is why it's called that. Um, so if you're looking to really just get some healthy things in your home, um, rather than maybe the cleaning products you're using, thieves is definitely something you'd like to talk to Lucinda I about. Um, follow up with us for sure, because it is an amazing oil. It has supported our immune system for a long time and helps us sick. My kids just had fevers last week and this helped break their fevers. So awesome stuff. All right, pan away. Think pain away. That's what I think when I think pan away. Provides a soothe, pulling sensation when applied after exercise or even any time, right? So sometimes I'll, um, you know, have some soreness when I'm waking up and I'll like to rub pan away on. Sorry, this is my daughter trying to get the video. Okay, in the shower, thank you. And um, this is one that you want to dilute. It is a hot oil. So it means it's spicy, not like it's going to burn a hole in your skin or anything, but just like a jalapeno, if you were to get some in your eye, it would kind of burn. So make sure you're diluting this. Make sure you're not using it on any of your hoo-ha parts, okay, or putting it in your eyes, things like that. So uh, pan away would be something really good for a foot bath, not for a full body bath. Ouch, okay. So just putting that out there. Peace and calming, something I need right now is, um, this is a really good for uh, 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 getting that comforting aroma, promoting relaxation, creates a peaceful environment. I like to set up um, areas of success. So I like to, before I do homeschool, I like to diffuse before I do homeschool um, because it kind of sets up the room with that aroma uh, before the kids are getting started, right? Or if I have company over, I like to kind of, uh, do a few things in my house to set the environment before they come over. Peace and calming is really good for kiddos. I diffuse it. I put it in their bath, in their in their shower, all the things. Um, it's a really good one to kind of make like a room spray out of as well. And also a good one to make a rollerball with, which we said we'll show you later on. Raven. This is called my flu, flu fighter. I always rub this one on my... Um, kids spine if they have a fever fever are held in the spine so i will um dilute that this always really uh breaks their fever I, okay i found thieves to do that as well um one second please and i really love that um it really helps kind of like like i always feel really congested if i'm always feeling really congested i like to use raven a lot um there's also the thieves um chest rub actually I have right here but raven is definitely a really good one for if you're you're needing kind of that clear up things like that um I usually only use this one when I'm sick so it's a really really good one to have another one to have in your arsenal stress away something that every mom or everyone probably needs. I have a bottle of this like in my purse, in my car, um, next to my bed, in my bathroom. Um, it is smells so good, you guys. This is the first oil I ever smelled from Young Living and I totally fell in love. Um, it definitely reduces daily stress, helps those nervous tensions, um, encouraging relaxation. Another good one to, sorry. Another good daughter needs to sing in the shower. Um, another good one to um, put, uh, you know, like around our neck or on our chest. Another one to kind of set our intentions. I like to set the intentions of kind of having a less stress environment. I'll put that in diffuser. diffuser. So I've also used stress away. If you carry stress in a part of your body, right? Some people carry it in their head. Some people carry it in their neck. Some people carry it in their back, some people on their feet, some people on their stomach. 
where you carry stress and you have pain, use stress away, not pain away. So I've had times where I'm like, oh, peppermint's not working. Nothing's working in my stomach. And I realize I'm, my stomach's hurting because I'm stressed out. So I will put stress away on my stomach and it'll go away because my body is stressed from that. So that's definitely something to think about. Um, stress away doesn't just have to be for like emotional stress. Valor. Valor is an amazing oil. Awesome. Promotes, um, encourages the positivity and confidence. I like to, when I'm super anxious or nervous, I like to um, use Valor a lot. If I'm going somewhere, I actually use Valor. Like I said, I'm in the bathroom. So all the things I use all the time right here. Valor right here. I do it in something called a good day protocol every morning. Um, but it is a very good thing um, to help promote those. It helps ground. I like to help use it to sleep. I like to put it in the, in the bath or shower. I have actually used Valor, um, for everything. So pan away, I'll use more for like immediate kind of muscle soreness and relaxation, things like that. Valor. So if you, a lot of times I'll wake up, you know, you have like that creaky neck, stiff neck. I used Valor on the base of my neck and spine one day, and that went away in like two days. And I'm usually out for like a week when that happens. So uh, Valor is definitely something to also use topically, um, but I think more for like, uh, you know, if there's like kind of something sore that you need to massage out or whatever in the next few days, this is a really good oil to help support you. All right, guys. So um, thank you so much. I have Lucinda here. She's going to talk about some amazing products that are also in the premium oil starter kit. She's going to tell you how to get roller bars, bar balls started. And she's going to tell you how else to get started. So thank you guys so much. I am right here to answer questions. Hi friends. Like Kathy said, my name's Lucinda White and I've been with Young Living since last June and what an amazing journey that I've been on. And that journey all started because of Sass Martin. So if you ever see her in person, say thank you for that. So um, the oils that we've been, um, that Sass has been talking about tonight come in what they call a premium oil starter kit. Also in that starter kit, um, you do get a few other products. We have the Thieves Spray, which is along the same lines as the Thieves Oil. This is like a little disinfectant spray. You can take it on the go with you to quickly clean like shopping cart handles or door handles. They also make a Thieves Hand Sanitizer, very portable. Um, it comes in the little, you know, hand sanitizer bottles. They also have some cool holders that you can clip on. But if you're tired of paying the price once you get this, if you don't want to get the little bottles all the time, they also sell a huge bottle of refill. Um, the other item that's in the premium starter kit, which is absolutely a fantastic product, it's the Ningxia Red. Ningxia Red is a wolfberry supplement. I drink probably four to six ounces of Ningxia a day. And the big difference that I've seen last November, I went to the eye doctor and this is the first time in six years that my eyes had not gotten a little worse. They had actually gotten better. And so I'm attributing that to my drinking of Ningxia Red every day. So fantastic products. Um, like Kathy said, our other part of our um, presentation tonight is roller balls. Kathy did show you some of her roller balls, but to do a roller ball, don't feel that you have to get these commercially made roller balls here with the filament tops. You can save, once you use a lot of oils like myself and Kathy do, we save our used um, roller ball, or uh, excuse me, our used oil bottles. We soak the labels off. You can put your oil blends in there. And then Young Living does sell what they call the Aroma Glide Roller Fitment. They come 10 to a pack. And those are the main items that you need to make a roller ball. You also need what Kathy was saying earlier is you need a carrier oil. And most of your oils, if you're brand new to oils, you have to be really careful if you're putting them on your skin, um, if you're putting them on um, kids' skin. But there are several oils out there that you can mix it with. I have sweet almond oil. I've also used the um, jojoba oil. So feel free to take a screenshot of this. Young Living does sell um, their V6 oil. So um, just, just a little bit of info on your various carrier oils. So to make a roller ball, um, 
I'm just going to stop my share really quick. You would take your roller ball, I mean your your bottle, which I just got today as part of my oint, my order. Take the top off. It comes with a fill, fitment top. You would just take that off, add your drops of oil into it, and then fill it up with the rest of your carrier oil. So very easy to do. So um, let me go back to our presentation here. And sorry, it went out of the screen. So give me one second and we'll get right back to our screen. And as Kathy's kids were, sorry, there we go. As Kathy's kids were talking earlier, I'm also a single mom of a special needs young lady. So you might hear her in the background, but she's probably telling me her movie's done. So we're just gonna move on and then I'll take care of her in a little bit. But roller balls, you can use for, any number of items. This screen right here just shows you some of the recipes. And you might be wondering how many drops to put in. And that's pers your personal preference. Some people like a really strong scent. Some people just like a gentler scent. But there's one called Wake Up, Immunity Booster, Muscle Relief, Seasonal Support. I just gave my daughter one last night that had um, peace and calming and stress away in it. Um, Digize and Peppermint for your happy tummy. Breathe, afternoon hustle. There are so many different combinations. Here's another quick um, screen with various recipes. So like I said, feel free to take a screenshot of this. And my order that I just got, I just got some vetiver. So I'm really interested to start trying that one. This one right here, it's called Just Chill. I diffuse that quite a bit. And that's the one I gave my daughter in her rollerball. Very gentle, and like it says, it calms you down and takes you away. So um, we are also having a DIY class this summer on diffuser bombs. So if you're interested, let us know and we can get you the invite to that and then you can make your own diffuser bombs. So what is your best value to get started? It is the starter kit. Young Living has probably nine or 10 different starter kits based on what your need is. They have a Ningxia Red, they have the various oil starter kits. And with your oil starter kits, you do have a choice of which diffuser that it comes with. You also have a CBD starter kit. Um, there's a Chilt Kiddo starter kit. There's one with just so many different choices. And starter kits are your best overall value. This starter kit right here, if you were to buy each of these items individually, it would be well over $400. But these oil starter kits run between $140 and $165. So fantastic way to get started. You get a little bit of everything in here. So if you are ready to get started with Young Living, you can start shopping right away. Um, there's also another really fantastic deal. You get to unlock, when you go shopping with your very first order, you can unlock a 25 per, or excuse me, 24% discount just by filling your cart with 100 PV, that's point product value, or adding any item to subscribe to save, which we'll talk about in just a little bit. Subscribe to save rocks and it is super fun and affordable way to start kicking the toxins out of your home and replacing them with safe options. You can um, do that with your oils. You can do that with the thieves line. And we also do a class on detoxing your home. So we can invite you to that. When you check out, you could add your referral ID number, which would be the person who introduced you to Young Living. Um, you can reach out to Sasserai, there is Kathy, and we can give you our referral number and help you um, with any questions you might have. Another perk to this is you could also become a brand partner with Young Living, which is what I am. SAS is also a brand partner. And we're brand partners because we love to share the info about Young Living, what it's done with us, and what it can help you support with your various health needs. So subscribe to save is loyalty rewards. It used to be called essential rewards, but now it is called loyalty rewards. What is subscribe to save? It is what we call your custom wellness box. You might be thinking custom wellness box. Each month you can get the same products. You can change them. You can do what your body or your mind or your spirit needs for that month. 
The best thing that I like about this is it gets delivered right to your door. I came home from a long day at work and my Young Living order was on my doorstep and it was wonderful to open it up and see all the products. Like we said, you can change what you order every month. And another thing that they've added recently within the past year is the frequency that you can get your products delivered. You can get them delivered one every month, every two months or every three months. And you can also change the date when you get those delivered. I get mine delivered at the beginning of the month and I'm like, I look forward to that every month. And there is no commitment. If you don't wanna have an item on subscribe to save or do that anymore, there's no penalty. You can let your person who enrolled you know and they can help you with that. Loyalty rewards. This is Young Living's way of paying you to buy their fantastic products. You earn points every month. You can spend them like store credit. You also get bonus gifts when you use your loyalty rewards. The only thing is, is that you have to order a minimum of 50 PV every month to keep this reward status going. Your monthly points you get back based on how many months you've been with Young Living. I've been with Young Living almost a year. So right now I'm at the 20% back. But if you first join them, you get one between one and three months, you get 10% back. Between four and 24 months, you get 20% back. 25 plus months, which SAS is at, 25% um, back. This is free money. I like to spend free money. And so when I see that I have some loyalty reward points in there, I'm like, what new product can I try now? So I am really going to make a go of it for the next two to three months, not to spend my loyalty rewards and build up a lot of point value. There's some oils that I want to try, but they're a little bit out of the normal price range for me. But if I save up my loyalty rewards, I can get the product for free. Who doesn't like getting free products? Young Living recently changed their, they call it their reward level. You used to get free shipping if you ordered 100 PV or more. Now they've taken that away and you get a fantastic product at the 100 P level, PV level for free, another free product. And they've gone to what they call flat rate shipping. And as you can see here, Three to nine business days, $7.99. It doesn't matter how much it weighs. It, this can go up to 150 pounds and you will still only pay $7.99. But if somebody was to order 150 pounds worth of Young Living, they're probably gotten a lot of diffusers, a lot of heavy other products, but this is such a fantastic deal. Young Living also does free products based on your point value. So this month is the first time I've ever seen them giving you product if you order 100 PV. The next level for this month is 190. They also go up to 250, 300. These product levels are cumulative. If you read, say like the 300 PV, not only do you get what's offered at that level, but you also get everything underneath it. Like I said, showed you before that the 300 level this time is the amethyst roller and you also get vanilla with it. So such fantastic oils and such fantastic products. I'm actually diffusing right now vanilla and tangerine. My daughter calls it the creamsicle smell. So my house smells like a creamsicle. So um, wonderful ways to get started. So we like to thank you for coming. Reach out to Sasserai if you have any questions. Um, and Sass is back. So there we have it. So thank you for watching and coming tonight. And we hope you can get some of these wonderful products. Yes, thank you so much. Um, so I actually will be offering a free rollerball to anyone who reaches out or anyone who um, watches this class that is not a current member. So you send that, you send this class, we recorded this. Um, if you send this to someone and they watch it and let you know what they liked, let me know. I'll send them a free gift. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I can do that. All right. Bye friends. Good job, everyone. Good job. Listen. Bye.